Hello guys, my name is Thomas and today I'm gonna be speaking about the arginine. I wrote a few lines in my thesis about the arginine, so I decided uh, I will share a little bit of knowledge with you. Everything what you will hear in this video was confirmed by a scientific research and uh, used in practice by me as a bodybuilder. But I must warn you because this is uh, one of my first English videos and my English is not perfect yet, so please be patient, I will try to do more videos in English and I hope it will get better. Ergo, er, ergo Jenny. Doufám, že vás moc nejasi doborci, ale dneska to bude takový anglický pokus trošku. I was doing some reviews or information videos for Czech people in Czech language and uh, I decided to do uh, videos about the substances which is inside this product. My prayer by My Protein, it's a prayer workout. So if you will be interested in these kind of videos, I will try to do maybe subtitles for the last videos or maybe do a new videos uh, just English, just please let me know. There is uh, arginine inside this product, but in my opinion there is not enough of the arginine, because there is only 500 milligrams uh, for single dose. You can find arginine even inside this product. There is. Uh, 1.25 grams of arginine in, in single dose but I think it's not enough also and I will tell you why right after. Currently I'm using this product, it's a pure arginine by my protein and it's better because it's pure arginine and you can make your own dose. You can get like 5 grams of arginine by this one pretty easy and it would be like uh, 10 scoops of this one but it's a good way to improve this one with pure arginine and it's kind of cheap you will get this 250 grams for a few bucks I will list the link uh, below the video so you can check it out after arginine is a semi-essential amino acid it means it's essential for a body uh, during the period of growth or maybe when the body is weakened by some illness and it's synthesized from ornithine in the body and for us bodybuilders, arginine is good because it can be used as the transport medium for indigenous nitrogen and this nitrogen can be used to create the nitric oxide inside the vascular endothelium and this nitric oxide is the molecule what gives us the vasodilation and it means it can give us the good pump during the workout. The greatest feeling you can get in a gym or the most satisfying feeling you can get in the gym is the pump. It's as satisfying to me as uh, coming is. And that's why it's used very often as the primary substance of the pre-workout supplements. Not only the pump is good for us during the workout because it feels good, but it means there is a better blood flow inside the muscles which means it has better supply by the oxygen and the nutrients and it means you can gain more muscles besides this when the arginine is used in a bigger single dose it can have positive impact on the endogenous synthesis of growth hormone and maybe even the insulin but only the positive impact on growth hormone was confirmed by the scientific research so far other positive things about the arginine are the inhibitory effect on the tumor cells or bacteria. It can improve the rheological quality of the blood, so it means it can be used as the prevention for the atherosclerosis. Not for, but against. Sorry, my English. It has positive impact on the immune system and the nitric oxide is also the neurotransmitter in the brain. And last but not least, it can positively affect the proteosynthesis, which is good for bodybuilders, right? I must say that the vasodilation and the er 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 ergogenic, ergogenic effect after a single dosage was not confirmed by the scientific studies. So it looks like the pump is caused mainly by the other substances uh, inside the pre-workout supplements. But there are a few really good things about the arginine which was confirmed and it's the ability of reducing the fat and uh, increasing the lean muscle. Simply, it positively affects the fat to muscle ratio. It was confirmed by the study which tested the effectiveness of the L-arginine in obese rats. It means 
really fat threads if you don't understand my English. These threads were divided into two groups. First group was taking the arginine and the second group was not. The second group was without any supplements and the obesity of the reds were induced by the nutrients. Test took 12 weeks and after those 12 weeks the reds were killed to obtain tissues. I mean tissues like tissues, not like these tissues. I don't know if it's pronounced good. The weight of the fat tissue, I mean this fat, was increased by 98% in the second group which was not taking the arginine but only by the 35% in the first group which was taking the arginine. Moreover, the arginine supplemented reds gained 13% more of muscles. This means the arginine supplementation shifts the nutrient partitioning to promote muscle over fat gain but it has to be taken long term eight or 10 weeks or more. Next study was taken in order to confirm the positive effect of arginine on the growth hormone secretion. It was also confirmed and it has the best results when the 9 grams of arginine was taken in single dose. They tried the 5 grams of arginine uh, which was not enough and they tried even the 13 grams of arginine which was simply too much. So it simply means that the arginine is effective but it has to be taken long term and you should take 5 to 10 grams in single dose. I recommend you to try the dose of maybe 3 grams and then increasing up to 10 grams a day because everybody is different and you can react differently. I hope you enjoyed the video. I tried to do my best. I hope you understand my English and please guys let me know uh, what kind of videos would you like to see here what kind of content if you have any questions write me in, down below in the comments i will try to make some question and answer video or whatever thanks for watching if you enjoyed the video please hit that like button and i will see you in the next video i want to introduce my dandoslav he's my gym buddy and he's sponsored by adidog